Good afternoon. My name is Tracy Reed, and I want to thank you for attending the Telebehavior Health staff training session today. What is Telebehavior Health and Telehealth and the purpose of its use? Telehealth is the use of information and communication technology to provide long-distance clinical health care, patient education, and information administration. Telehealth is provision of behavioral health care through real-time two-way voice conferencing. It's used by health care to improve patient access to treatment and care of behavioral health conditions, especially for those patients experiencing challenges in accessing in-person care. Some of the benefits of telebehavior health will be cost and time efficiency, improves patient satisfaction, enhances care and treatment of mental health conditions. Telebehavior health decreases the cost of travel to and from the doctor's office while increasing access to behavioral health care. The technology has been associated with increased patient satisfaction gives opportunity to respond to patient conditions in real time. This enables early treatment and management of symptoms, hence reducing hospitalization and emergency care visits. It improves communication between a physician and the patients. Telebehavior help therefore gives staff the opportunity to plan care interventions and ways to improve the quality of care. What are some of the risks associated with the technology? It would be network security risks, compliance risks, patient confidentiality and, and privacy risks, technical difficulties, and there are some security issues. Some of the key concerns and risks for te telebehavior help are operating and using the technology requires technical knowledge for both the patient and the physician. Additionally, adapting to technology requires initial investment and periodic maintenance. This technology depends on broad broadband connectivity. The internet connectivity determines if patients will use the technology. And this could hinder the use of technology by communities that are located in rural areas. Another risk that is associated with this technology is failure to comply with the HIPAA telehealth regulations, which may result to terminate of the program and reputational damage. HIPAA requires are in regards to privacy, confidentiality, and the patient's data. Therefore, measures must be taken during counseling sessions to protect the patient's data. Telehealth requires internet connectivity. Unprotected network is a threat to the program. The organization must therefore use a secure network to protect patient information and email and session notes. Some of the requirements for sex successful deployment would be um, technology requires the right infrastructure. Although the infrastructure depends on the specific technology to be adopted, the basic infrastructure common to all healthcare programs, including telebehavior health, are broadband connectivity, technical support staff, and staff training and equipment. Community partnership is one of the requirements for a successful implementation of the technology. Partnering with the community will improve decision-making pertaining to training and use of the technology. Community partnership will include collaborating with the students, their parents, and the teachers. Staff training is important and it requires for the success of the technology. With well-trained staff, the transition to the new technology will be seamless. 
The staff will be trained on how to use the technology, the legal requirements associated with the technology, and the ethics during interaction with patients. Patients and their families trained in critical or is critical for the success of the program. Patients who are the students and their parents will be trained on how to use this technology. For instance, setting up technology and ethical interactions with physicians during the sessions, as well as privacy and confidentiality requirements. Patient confidentiality and priority safeguards. The confidentiality and security of patient data is a critical aspect of the technology. HIPAA requires Requirements apply to all healthcare providers adapting telehealth programs. Cybersecurity compliance and privacy of electric records is important. HIPAA requires standard physical, technical, and administrative security st- strategies and proper handling of sensitive patient data to ensure security, integrity, and availability of t- patient's data. Complying with the requirements will enable the organization mitigate risks associated with cyber threats. Assessing the effectiveness of the technology. The effectiveness of the technology will be enabling using various strategies. Patient and staff surveys will be administered to determine the level of satisfaction with the technology and the general perception of the staff towards the technology. The feedback obtained through the surveys will be used to determine if the technology is effective or not. Corrective measures will be then developed based on that feedback. Stakeholders, especially management, will be interviewed to determine their views pertaining to the technology, and various outcome measures will be assessed to determine the effectiveness of the technology, for instance, reducing the level of emergency visits to behavioral health-related conditions will indicate effectiveness of, uh, the effectiveness of the technology. Ongoing training and support. Troubleshooting and technology's use, communication, safety and privacy, and service delivery. The ongoing training and support for the program will always be needed once the program is implemented. Open and honest communication should be an ongoing process. Staff will be trained to provide important information relating to their interaction with the patients. This will also be trained on how to deal with challenges that arise. The organization and management will provide an environment that promotes reporting. As part of support, the IT team will constantly monitor compliance of the the HIPAA requirements and policies in place. And additionally, the team will provide constant security of the technology and its infrastructure. Questions and concerns will be channeled to the manager and the IT team. Periodical staff training will be conducted to remain, to remind them of the policies and regulations and issues that may arise. The rules of the nurse, improving access to telebehavioral health, treatment, effective care, providing mental health care to those that need it. Because nurses have the role of leveraging the benefits of technology to improve the quality of care. Implementation of the telehealth technology is a great opportunity for nurses to improve behavioral health conditions in rural communities. The technology will also give nurses the opportunity to to enhance patient education through technology. I thank you for lending me your time. Any questions, I will be glad to address them at this time. Thank you.